you keep in your purse. Not this. <laughs> this can go with you. This stays in the kitchen. Today, folks, I'm going to be reacting to a video from Generation Hope. They make these kind of like PSA after school, specially kind of videos. But this one is super woke and super hilarious. So as a warning, if you or somebody who can't tolerate my laugh or you have a problem with my laugh, do not watch this video because I'm going to be laughing through this whole entire video because this is one of the funniest things in the history of ever. And I just wanted to put this video out because I wanted to give you guys something really fun. And <laughs> so I want to show you something fun that you could laugh at and have a good time with because I think we definitely need more of that. So let's share some laughs together. Hey. Okay, we're three seconds into the video and I'm already done. Like I'm done. <laughs> this woman brought a whip to the basketball court. <laughs> what did I tell you criminals about coming back to my neighborhood? I'm oh, not Roy, let's just get out of here. No Vince, I won't let her ruin our fun. Listen lady, we aren't breaking any laws to having fun here at the park. I won't let you intimidate us anymore. Are you talking back to me, boy? <laughs> I guess you forgot who used to own your kind, and I'm about to remind you of that right now. Oh my gosh, look at this guy here. He pulled it up. He's like, he's like, he's trying to low key record this woman with his cell phone. You know how like most people have their phones out like this? He's, he's hiding it though, because he, he said he's so afraid of this chick. Like, what is this? What is this? What year do they think that this is? to remind you of that right now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, she's whipping his legs. He's paralyzed. He's, he's supposed to be paralyzed in a wheelchair. And she's whipping his legs and he can feel it. <laughs> and she's hit the ground. She's nowhere near close to his legs. Don't you touch him or I will knock your teeth out. Roy, hang on. I'll get some help. And he left. <laughs> if a man left, why did he leave? He left his friend in the wheelchair and went to just sit there and get whipped. <laughs> Come on. Come on. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Okay, so, like, the people who wrote this, they are such crazy feminists that they, they actually believe that this woman can knock this guy's teeth out. Come on now. <laughs> they made my man into a simp and a coward. He can't save his friend from this tiny, tiny white woman. Come on now. Come on. This is just the guy in the wheelchair explaining that he got in the wheelchair as a result of a car accident that killed his father, but he's just really happy and grateful to be alive still. Look at these hood rats infesting my neighbor. <laughs> I wish they all just went away. <laughs> I, I I used to say that all the time when I lived in the hood. <laughs> that way we could keep it pure like the good old days. <laughs> <laughs> what year do the people who wrote this think that this is? I know that there are people who still have prejudices and whatnot but seriously like what what i don't even say neighborhood it's like a public park where hey, are the houses the there are no street. criminals here you know the loitering is illegal right not that your kind of people like to follow the rules but as long as i'm here i'm gonna make sure that this neighborhood is safe yeah. why are you being so rude lady um yeah we're not criminals First of all, if these if these guys really were hood rats and this chick came up <laughs> to them in real life, you know, this would have been a whole nother video, okay? I mean, this would have been a whole nother video. For people just like you, we live here. You do not live here, you filthy rat. Now give me that ball <laughs> and get out of my neighborhood. Ma'am, we're not giving you a ball. That's stealing. It's our ball. If you don't give me that ball, <laughs> Right now, I'm gonna call the police and tell them that you assaulted me. Why would you lie like that? I've done nothing wrong to you. <laughs> a little cripple like you or a sweet, scared little white lady like me. 
Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Stop. Stop. This dude is in a wheelchair. I don't understand this. Why, if she was calling the cops, why wouldn't they have her say that the able-bodied guy is the one who assaulted her? What did this dude who is in a wheelchair from a car accident, what did he do to you? Honestly, honestly, if the cops show up, I think they're going to believe the guy in the wheelchair. But is she going to tell him that he kicked her or something? Come on now. So what would actually happen is the cops would show up. She would start spouting this crazy racist nonsense. And they would figure out that she's lying and that the dude in a wheelchair did nothing to her at all. And, and they'd probably take her to jail instead of them. Roy, just give her the ball, man. Just get out of here. It's not worth the trouble. Yeah. Listen to your friend, Tyrone. Or you're gonna regret it. What? No. No. Now that's a good. No. 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 This is just this is SJW subliminal messaging where you just give women your balls and go home. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Actually, you know what? I just I switch teams. I just now switched teams since he gave her his balls. I'm I'm done with him. I'm done. I'm done. A little slave. Oh my gosh. Oh! 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 Get out! Get out! No! She's got a knife! She just she just had a she just has a giant knife in her hand. Wait, how did that happen? Oh my gosh, this, this bimbo is a show. Oh, wow. my God. You got issues, lady. Whoa, this is my travel companion, okay? It's cute, it's pink, it folds. <laughs> this is what you keep in your purse. Not this. <laughs> Get out. <laughs> you know what? Maybe, maybe I'm back on their side again, man. If you're if you're walking around with butcher knives. Maybe they should have just given her the ball and left. I don't know. I, I think I'm back with my guys now. They just made this woman completely psycho. <laughs> That's what I thought. I hope I never see those thugs running around my neighborhood again. Actually, I hope I never see him again either. <laughs> I know, I know. Those are some, those are some weak dudes. <laughs> You're too weak to be around me. I can't hang out with guys like that. <laughs> or some simps. I think she's doing the community a service. <laughs> hey, baby. How was your day? Whoa, 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 whoa. Slow down there, champ. Is everything okay? It's fine. Nothing. I mean, you gotta tell her. Roy, you know I'm your mother. And mothers always know when they're children. I didn't know she was his mother. They look like they're about the same age to me. Wonder if they're doing that whole, uh, <clears throat> looks like they're perpetuating that stereotype of black women having kids super young. Like as teenagers. I'm lying to them. Talk to me. What's the matter? This racy, racist white lady was calling me names and threatening to call her cops if I didn't meet the basketball court. I didn't do nothing. As a matter of fact, her skin looks way younger than his skin. Like he's got these lines, these forehead lines here. Her skin is just beautiful. This woman has some beautiful, flawless looking skin though. This racy, racist white lady was calling me names and threatening to call her See, look, her skin is fabulous. She's got some great skin, which to me, her skin is younger than, it looks younger than his, but we just. The cops, if I didn't need the basketball court, I didn't do nothing. When did this happen? Just now? Yes. Me and Vince were playing and she just came up to us screaming at us. She even took my basketball and popped it with a knife. <laughs> Listen to me, Rob. Dude, if you're, <laughs> dude, dude, you know what your your dad would have done? 
he he would have maybe helped that wheelchair get out of there a little faster. Clearly, your father did not raise a man. I know that you miss your father and that everything has been crazy since the accident. I miss him too. He always knew what to say when something bad happened. But unfortunately, he's gone. Oh, that's messed up. Boy. You might be disabled, but you can still stand up for yourself. Oh, boy. If somebody is pushing you around. You're still disabled, but you can stand up for yourself. I'm sure they thought that was powerful writing there. If somebody is pushing you around and trying to intimidate you, don't let them do that. You should let them know that they shouldn't be doing that. You got it? But, scary. I, I know it's scary. All of this is scary. I get scared. You get scared. But that doesn't mean you don't stand up for yourself. Okay, even your father got scared. No, 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 no. Why are they infantilizing this man? You know, even your father got scared. Really? Daddy got scared sometimes? Come on, how old is this man? I mean, this guy, he's got, this this actor here, he's got four headlines. I mean, he's probably at least in his mid-20s. And by his mid-20s, he has it figured out that daddy gets scared sometimes, too. I can't wait to see what his face looks like when he finally figures out how babies are made. <laughs> Come on now. Yes, really. <laughs> Here's an actual. I know you may be too young to remember, but your father and I used to have a crazy white neighbor who used to always bother us just because we were black. He tried to get us evicted. He lied and said that we would play our music too loud and that we damaged his property. But you know what? Your father and I never let him win. Weren't you scared? Of course we were scared. It's terrifying having a crazy white neighbor trying to mess up your life. But it's not about being scared. It's about standing up for yourself while being scared. I'm not saying that racism does not exist, okay? <laughs> That's not what I'm saying. I've definitely experienced racism in my life, but this portrayal that they're doing here is just completely over the top clown world stuff. Clown world. White white people running around with whips <laughs> because they would hit so hard. <laughs> they would hit so hard. It's over the top. Like, it's hard to take anything else seriously. Like, honestly, they're just making a mockery of the Black experience in 2021. Or 2020, or whatever year this video was made. I'm not sure when the original was made. But it's a hard mom. I don't know if I can do it. I'm stuck in this wheelchair. Roy, you're not handicapped. You're handicapable. Oh. Don't let someone do you like that. You probably won't even run into that crazy white lady anymore. But you have a right to be outside. Don't let her take that from you. Don't let her take that from you unless you're outside without a mask on or if you haven't taken the poke. <laughs> you got that? Yes, ma'am. And call me right away the next time something like this happens. Nobody is going to be out there messing with my boy. You're my baby. Now, Go ahead, get some rest. You've had a long day. All right? Thanks, Mom. I love you. Thanks so much for cheering me up. Uh, who, who talks to their grown son like that? Go ahead and get some rest now. Come on. I need it. That was nice, what the mom did. All right, it's the next day, and the mom gives her son a new basketball. Remember what we talked about. Don't live in fear, honey. And if that crazy lady comes up to you, I am just a phone call away. The basketball court is five minutes down the street. And if you call me, I'll be there to see you. Go and have some fun, okay? Okay. This reminds me of that expression, when seconds count, the police are only minutes away. <laughs> like, what, like what, what kind of SJW logic is this well okay um i know you're in a wheelchair right and you have to deal with a crazy lady who has a whip 
and a knife and is who is completely unhinged and likes to stab things. But if you can hold on and just get whipped or stabbed for two minutes, if you can just hold on, I will be there. Okay. <laughs> because of his disability, he's clearly at a disadvantage and will be so for as long as he can't walk. Like he's, he's going to be more of a target for folks. But if she really cared about him, she'd send him out with a pew pew. About a little Cindy Lou pew pew. I love the Second Amendment. It's perfect for self-defense scenarios. So much, Mom. I love you. <laughs> oh, I'm on my way out now. Ben just texted me. He'll be there. Oh, okay. I gotta go. Okay, have fun. What took you so long, Slowpoke? Dude, remember? Wheelchair? <laughs> okay, I see you got a new basketball. <laughs> Wanna play a game? Let's do it. All right, show me what you got. Oh. <laughs> Does she really have nothing else to do? <laughs> Keys are back at it again. Oh, and by the way, if she really is this racist, she didn't call them monkeys. You know what she called them. I'll teach them a lesson they won't forget. Oh. Hey. What did I tell you criminals about coming back to my neighborhood? I oh, know, Roy, let's just get out of here. Oh. No, Vince. I won't let her ruin our fun. Listen, lady, we aren't breaking any laws by having fun here at the park. I won't let you intimidate us anymore. Are you talking back to me, boy? I guess you forgot who used to own your kind, and I'm about to remind you of that right now. Oh. Ah, that hurts. Ah, Vince, help. Ah. Don't you touch him or I will knock your teeth out. Stop. Stop! <laughs> Somebody's been watching too many movies with Mary Sue's in them where 98 pound women in heels can kick the crap out of 300 pound Russian dudes. Just, just stop. Stop it. Stop it. Yeah, I'm not going to question it. Roy, hang on. I'll get some help. Oh, look. You disabled, crippled piece of trash. No one's coming for you. You're not worth it. What? You and your kind, you are worthless. Now, it's been, what, 180 years since slavery was abolished? And I'm going to give you a lash for every year that that God-given right was taken away from me. I don't. Stop. <laughs> stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Oh, stop. Please stop. Please stop. Where are the people who are still mad that slavery is gone? Care. You can try and hurt me, but you won't break my spirit. My mom told me not to be afraid of evil people like you. And where's your mama now, huh? It's just you and me. So let's have a little fun. His mama is right here. Nobody messes with my boy like that, lady. You ought to be ashamed of yourself. Vince, call the cops and tell them that there's a lunatic at the park going around whipping people. <laughs> yeah, we have the eighth crime at Greensboro Park, 123 Main Street. All right, we'll be waiting. Baby, are you okay? Yes, Mom. She hit me a few times, but I didn't let her break my spirit or scare me away. Oh, this is insulting on every level. Because now, now we're at the point where... It took the heavy set black lady to come in and stop this woman. The dry, strong, able-bodied man couldn't step in to do something. He had to go, and it, it was two minutes away. I mean, two minutes was like 20 seconds for them in, in this in this thing here. Like this guy should have been stabbed and whipped for quite some time, but whatever. But notice how in this SJW nonsense, they won't let a man be a man. I don't want to live in this world here where grown men can't stand up to physical threats and they need to get their mommies to come help them. That's what you told me to do. Good. I'm glad you didn't let evil win. Your father would be so proud. What that that thing has a father? I'm not through with you yet. I'm going to make sure you go to jail for a long time. Who do you think they're going to believe? Huh? A criminal or an innocent white lady? Don't worry about that. I was recording the entire time you were attacking Roy. Now we have all the evidence we need to lock you up. Come on. 
You know, even with that video of this, man, you're not winning a trial. They are going to rule in my favor. They always do. This chick must not be watching the news. <laughs> and this looks like a citizen's arrest, which I thought you couldn't do either. Okay, they know that you people are criminals and liars and crack dealers. Lady, I don't know why you have so much hate in your heart, but good will always win over evil. Now sit here and be quiet. Why isn't this crazy lady stabbing somebody at this point? I mean, if she has this much hatred, real racists who have this much hatred would not be okay with a black person touching them. They wouldn't. Trust me, you don't want her to run out of patience. Hey, the cops are here. Once the cops arrived, Vince showed them the video evidence of Mallory whipping Roy. Mallory was arrested and sent to jail for her crimes. <laughs> However, Roy and Vince continue to enjoy playing basketball without anyone bothering them again. It's important to treat everyone with respect. That video had me laughing so hard my stomach muscles actually hurt from it. Well, I hope this uh, brained up your day a little bit. And I guess with that, I will see you in the next video. <laughs>